It's getting emotional up in here. Yeah, definitely. A lot of feelings going on. What would be the resounding feeling in each of you after what happened tonight? That's a great question. Oh, wow. I love that. You love that? Uh, my breath smells like pizza. I'm so sorry. <laughs> that I love that feeling. This yeah, it's over there. there. <laughs> um, I'm proud mm. of us. Yeah. Thankful for all of us. Yeah. Thankful and proud, for sure. Yeah. Uh, listen, I'm the same. I am. Um, uh oh. I'm so proud of all of us, and um, yeah, I think proud and grateful are perfect words. Well, you have a lot to be proud of. Yeah. Those are all beautiful performances, and they all brought out. I think some deep part of all of you. I saw different colors to all of you tonight. I heard different things in your voices. I saw, um, I felt like I saw your soul. Yeah. What part of you do you feel like was brought out tonight that maybe America or even you haven't seen before this? I saw Spencer's strength. I saw Pryor's confidence. And I think I'm not one to show vulnerability very often. Oh my god, I was just gonna say that. Yeah, yeah so I think you showed it tonight. Yeah. yeah. And I'm dealing with that right now. <laughs> Head back. It is beautiful. Head back. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Head back. Glad your breath didn't smell like pizza. Sorry. <laughs> I wish it did smell like pizza. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, I'm just proud I think of all Kyla of us. got it right. Yeah. I mean I hope people saw strength from me or definitely. Or like what it feels like to be passionate about something and I hope that's what they feel. I felt like you were standing in your truth. Oh. Wow. Mm -hmm. What people don't know is Spencia fought for that song. It was something that she made a decision in herself that she wanted to do and both of us were elated because a lot of times she'll just be like, oh okay, whatever you think. And so seeing her, that's why I said I saw strength. I saw her stand in something she believed in from the beginning and owned it and was absolutely wow. beautiful doing it. Wow. That's the truth. Wow. She's speechless. Very, <laughs> I have no hey, words. You got this on camera? This is a rarity. <laughs> 100%. I have no words. Very proud of you, baby. Thank you. Yeah. That's a big thing, especially as a woman. That's a really hard thing to do, yeah. to set boundaries and stand up for yourself mm. artistically. Mm. Ouch. She's on fire. And that's going to be a huge thing for the and rest think, of your career. You set yeah. the standard for this. And I think that I learned a lot of that from Kyla. Yeah. Don't do it. Okay. I keep getting chills all the way up and down my body. <laughs> you all are like, oh, give me the business in a good way. I always said that standing next to Pryor and Kyla make, makes me stronger. So, and I think they know, they know that. So. We annoy her. That's really all that is. Yeah. Especially but they also make me stronger. <laughs> I feel like out of, I mean, all the teams are special and they all have their different thing going on, but I feel like the three of you have such a genuine familial bond. Mm -hmm. Has that been from the beginning? Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. We're all original Since members the of, blinds, this, yeah. of this team. So mm -hmm. yeah. we've had this whole journey together, yeah. all three of us. Mm -hmm. uh, we've seen people come and we've seen people go and we hate yeah. to see it happen all the time, but, yeah. and we realize that it could happen to any of us at any time. So we're all grateful and we spend as much time together as we can. And yeah. We, have a really good time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very present. Yeah. Yep. And you all got some amazing comments from the judges tonight. Like, some, I was like freaking out when they were talking to you, actually. I was like, if that was happening to me, I would have just collapsed on the I stage and, and but, like been drowning in my puddle of tears. <laughs> no, I so I'm, I, it's amazing that you all didn't do that. But out of, out of tonight, or even the whole competition, but specifically tonight, I'm going to say, because we, we just went through it. What was the biggest comment you got from the judges that made you go, wow? I mean, I can think of one for you. Yeah. What yeah. Mr. Blake said. Yeah. Hello. Change country music history. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, hello. <laughs> Do you want us to, like, Hold on to it for you? Okay. I'll, I, I got gotcha. you. Okay. Um, that. I think she's still wrapping her mind. Yeah. Around well, this is a new genre for me. So. I, I love it, um, and I sing it every week with, with everything I have, but to have the trailblazer like Blake say, you're going to be successful in this genre, I can feel it. I don't Not know. just successful. Didn't he say you're going to change the genre forever? It did. <laughs> there's no words for me to, there's no, what do you say, I mean, 
what do you feel? I'm just everything probably. Yeah, just yeah. I don't know what what had, what are you how do you respond to that? He I said amazing he did, things to them too. No, he did. He did. She was gonna say no, he did, and I was like, yeah, pretty much. No, he re- no they <laughs> no never th- does. They they said amazing things to all you. That's why I asked the question because I think you all got some moments that were like like I said, puddle on the ground, crying, yeah. <laughs> passed out. Um, having Adam, you know, it's I love having Blake as a coach, but you know, they're always gonna say great things about you, hopefully. <laughs> uh, but Adam, you know. Noticing that you know I was able to go somewhere different with my voice this week, and mm-hmm. that's uh, that was something that I had to dig deep and find and get comfortable with. Wow! So to uh, have him say that was a great feeling, that's for sure. Mine actually came when I got off the stage. Mm. It's always the coaches always. I can't hardly take anything they say, <laughs> but I came off the stage actually to a very mean comment which was hilarious that I just got through singing a song about it. But right under it was a young lady who said that, I don't even know why I started this whole sentence. Here we go. Oh, I want to hear it now. What happened? What, what, she, what she basically said was that she was, she was contemplating suicide and listening to that song was all that she needed. And if all of us do music because we love it, but we want to change lives. Uh-huh. And so I think anything people say is worth it when you've touched one person when one person is is changed by anything you do yeah it means it doesn't matter who else says anything that's what touches your heart yeah yep i think we have to to leave it on that that was beautiful keep going with that intention and no matter what you'll be successful and i'm so excited to see you three next week thank you for being here thank you Mm, I love you. <laughs> there you go.